Hello there again. For Adam and others that are uh, have the 2.002 version of the software and, and not seeing the green screen, that is because there was a bug discovered in the green screen product in the 2.001 version, which is what I have up here. And they disabled it, so uh, Andrew disabled it so that he can make the repairs, and then I guess 003 we will have the green screen. But the purpose of this uh, beta release, along with the some of the first beta uh, users, myself and people even before me, um, the point of this is to test all this stuff so that we don't have to go through the same drama we did before with you know getting up to version 14 before things settle down. I still think it's going to get to version 7 before it settles down, but I don't think it's going to be as much. And with this effort here, uh, this will help us uh, make it perfect. Now, Adam asked about it, uh, the uh, the green screen video, so let's... Let me show you how that looks because my one my 001 version does have green screens enabled I have ran across some issues but they're not issues that have prevented me from experimenting so at least for those people that are waiting to see this let me show you what it does so I will put up um, let's see grab an image to have something as a background so that um, where they are there they are let's see uh, we'll just come up with this because it's a clean image and then I'm gonna bring in this Tron uh, HUD or head up display item that is gonna be a video with a black background and I'm gonna knock the background out so We'll just lock this, set it for full screen. Oh, let me set it proportionally. Okay, that's, there we are. And now I'm going to add a video. And let me go back over here. Still need to make some better shortcuts to my files. <clears throat> now these are um, MP4 Tron uh, HUDs. And I don't want to sketch it. Okay, there's the video. Now I'm not going to do anything, I'm just going to leave it as is. Let's close this. And there's the video playing, right? Okay, but you have the black background. I just want you to see that it is a video there and it is playing. So just click on green screen button right here. And it already recognizes that the color I want to knock out is black but you you do have the ability to go in here and choose your color all right so I'm gonna say green screen enabled boom these sliders adjust um, you know how much of the the halo or border you're trying to cut and everything else uh, so that's what you would adjust there but since I don't have a video a piece on frame one I don't see that so now it's clear so but I'm gonna leave it the same size when to get out of here and in just a second there it is now if I don't want to wait those seconds see right here it says this video is 962 frames actually that's not where I need to be uh, I guess I don't have that ability here but might want to make a note to Andrew about this but in the SWF you can tell it where to start and then how many frames to play this just tells you how many frames to play so this is 962 if I only wanted to play for 300 frames then I can just go in here and stand on this until it comes down to the length that I need and I've just reduced that video so this is this is how the green screen works and it works very really well um, I thought I had a couple of explosions this is a transporter let me just try this transporter. This is the transporter effect from Star Trek. Okay, so let me I'm gonna unlock this and scale this this way. Click on green screen, knock it out. Now it's got it's got a lot of black around it, so let's 
come in here and tweak this. It's easy when you have a frame there, but I started these with blank frames. Save changes. Eh, a little better. Uh, I might have to go crazy on this for a minute. This one removes the halo around the edges, and this one uh, is kind of like a threshold, basically, basically from my uh, usage and experience. So, so that's 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 a bit better right there. So now the full scene is the peppers are drawn. There's that uh, heads up display, and I, kinda, I this one I kind of sit at an angle if you can tail instead of it being straight up facing you and there is my transporter effect so uh, that's basically green screen if you have a green screen where you can actually see the first frame then you can tweak the sliders and it comes out really well if what I've also learned is that if you have videos that are pre matted black pre matted black then they punch out a lot better than some of the other ones all right so have a good day